Hi, I'm Gary Leventhal, the Commissioner of Great Neck Softball. We hope you enjoyed our highlights. This week, our featured player is Eric Toski. <laughs> tradition of the great American president, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, who addressed the American public in a fireside chat. Here we have one of the famous Great Neck stars, Eric the Uniborn, who will be interviewed by the Kamishugana. Our featured player, Eric Toski. Eric is a longtime member of the Great Neck Softball League, and uh, Eric is a third baseman, and uh, he has an unusual nickname. Eric, you want to tell us about that? Uh, apparently I've been given the nickname Eric the Uniform, and it's because I have uh, over the years collected every major league uniform, and I like to wear them to softball, which pretty much has me outdressed uh, most of the other players. And how many, you have every major league uniform? I have every major league uniform and some minor league uniforms as well. So that would be about how many? I guess I have probably about 40 uniforms up there. We'll show them to you later. And you wear a uniform to every game? Every game I wear a different uniform. Um, some years we've had such nice weather, we've had more than 40 games, so I've had to repeat, and then it's troubled me. But I, I'm going to have to, uh, I'm working on it, and every, every year I, I manage to get a few more. When you say it troubled you, how troubled were you? Well, not as troubled as when what? my arm socks are, are dirty and I have wearing my Baltimore Orioles uniform in orange is important, but it did trouble me. <laughs> okay, now I understand that um, you play in an annual Cooperstown game uh, once a year, um, and uh, it's for players over 30, Yeah. and something unusual, they actually heard about you being called Eric the Uniform up there. Well, what was that story about? I played with a group of guys that um, came up together and I was one of the three or four players that they were not familiar with. And one of them was a computer guy, and he decided to Google me. And it came up that when he Googled my name, some of your stuff that you had written for the Great Neck Record uh, popped up. And he knew that I was a big fan of, of uniforms. And he said, oh, you're Eric the Uniform. And I was like, I had was totally shocked. I had no idea how he, he found that out. But he said he did it just by Googling my name. So you are internationally famous for being uh, uh, the wearer of all these uniforms. <laughs> Thanks to you and your uh, your media arm. Oh, I'm, I'm glad I could, I'm glad I can help. Uh, so Eric, you play uh, you play ball several times a week. Uh, other than Great Neck softball, which is every Saturday and Sunday morning, where else do you play? I like to play hardball. I started playing hardball again when I was about 45. So I've been playing hardball for about seven years, and now I'm playing. Uh, I've played for a while with very young guys, very, very high strung, and uh, decided that they were a little too competitive, a little bit too crazy for me. So now I'm playing with um, very old people, uh, guys that have to be over the age of 48, but some of the guys are in their 60s and even in their 70s. And it's just giving me a chance to see how, uh, how I should behave as I get older and older and older and continue to play. Okay, well that sounds exciting. And um, so, I understand that you actually sometimes wear the uniforms in other places other than softball. Is that true? Um, I try to hide my identity when I wear the uniforms to other activities, but um, you may, you may be. Some of the pictures may surface. I don't know. of being a weekend warrior and playing every ball every Saturday and Sunday is, uh, is your home life. Uh, you have to have support from home, particularly your wife. Uh, Eric goes up to softball every Saturday and Sunday morning in uniform on his bike. And uh, I have now his wife, Sandia, who's obviously shown him a lot of support over the years. So um, he 
He can do whatever he wants. <laughs> All right, we have a question for the peanut gallery, Sandy. What what is your favorite uniform? In other words, which of Eric's uniforms really turns you on? Oh, I guess um, the red one. <laughs> <laughs> the red one. Let's take a little.